Hi. Long time no see. Put your shoes on, please. Get your heart rate monitor. A towel. Wait for the legs. Maybe a bottle of water because you're gonna get sweaty. All right. If you've got a heart rate monitor, start it up. Pick something like cross training because that's gonna be our focus today. We're doing cardio as well as some strength training. We're doing five minute rounds of cardio and only three exercises for strength training. Two of them legs, one of them upper body, but it's a to failure. So the upper body is gonna be timed. Not too crazy, because we're gonna do a few rounds. All right, here we go. If you want some music on your end, go ahead. We have a silent training day. Legs wide, please give me a nice big inhale. And exhale, do that again. I need to start it up. That's what I need to do. Big inhale and exhale. Nice, another one, big inhale and exhale beautiful job all right you're just going to tuck your chin to the chest and then let, rotate all the way back so forward and back as big as you can make it now maybe you can't let your head drop all the way back sometimes that's a little challenging for us based on vertigo based on mobility but as big as you can beautiful find yourself in neutral now left to right Again, as big as you can. At your own pace, maybe I'm going a little too fast for you or too slow, up to you. Find yourself in neutral. And now gently roll your head, any direction, all the way around. Feel for all those crevices. Maybe slow down if you're feeling a little dizzy. Beautiful, and the other direction. We want three big rolls in the other direction. Nice job. Oh, hello neck, fantastic. Take your hands just north of the knees. Give me a standing cat cow. Good. At your own pace, all of these nice stretches, waking up the body, beautiful. Slide your hands down to tabletop. I want your legs to be as straight as possible, but just the fingertips on the ground, just the fingertips. Head up, chin up, back flat, belly sucked in. Head up, look at me, nice, nice job. Now bend your knees deeply, place both your hands flat on the ground, step back into plank. Ah, excellent, stay here in plank, beautiful. Get that butt to be in line with the shoulder. Now we're doing plank to down dog, so push the butt up into down dog, legs straight, both of them, and then come into plank. Beautiful, two more times. Push into down dog, legs straight, come into plank. One more time, push into down dog. Excellent job, hold it here. Walk out the dog. That means you're bending one knee at a time. Just kind of moving those legs, excellent. Bend both your knees, place them on the ground, find yourself in all fours. Nice. Drive the right leg all the way forward. Low lunge. Half runner's lunge. Excellent. Good. Take that leg all the way back. Calf stretch. All the way forward. Half runner's lunge. Stay on that right leg. If you need to scooch or inch your leg forward and back, that's okay. Last time. Excellent. Hold it here. Lift your right hand up to the ceiling. Turn your head. Look at those fingers. Greatest stretch in the world, they say. Excellent, take that right hand back down to the outside of the right leg now and push back, stretching out the hamstring. Rocking forward and back. So we don't wanna really hold any of the stretches just yet. Wanna do some dynamic stretches. It's just slightly different warm up today. Excellent job. Find yourself in all fours. Give yourself the room you need to to come back into all fours. Good, left side. Left leg all the way forward, half runner's lunge. Take a moment, push back, calf stretch. Now rock forward and back, moving that leg all the way forward. If you need to scooch that leg, you know, wiggle it, go right ahead, your workout. Nice, now keep it all the way forward. Join me here, lift the left hand, open it up. Turn the head, look at the fingers. World's greatest stretch. Fabulous job, bring the left hand down to the outside of that left leg, hamstring. Oh, forward and back, just rocking forward and back. 
straightening that left leg, flexing that left foot. One more time. Three is the magic number, people. Excellent job. Give yourself enough room. Find yourself into all fours again. All right, now we're pushing into up dog or cobra. Drop the hips forward. Pin ball those shoulders, shaking it out. And we're gonna push back, keeping the knees on the ground. Child pose, up dog or cobra. Oh yes, child pose, up dog or cobra. Fabulous. And then push back into child pose. Excellent, stay right here for a second. Walk the hands over to the right, so you're stretching the left side body. Walk the hands over to the left, so you're stretching the right side body. Beautiful job. Come back to center. Sit up in hero pose for a second. Excellent. Whatever you need to do, push yourself into deep primal squat. So I lean forward, tuck my toes, come into deep primal squat. And I want you to walk forward to me. Hi. That's it. Movement on the ground. Very good for the joints. And say goodbye. Walk it back. A little bit more awkward. I don't even know where my feet are going, but that's all right. Fantastic. Find yourself in the center. Push up to standing. Excellent. Give me a nice little march. Just start moving the body. My clock's fallen over, so I need to fix it so I can see what's going on. Just a nice steady march. Come on. Finish that warm up with me. So I don't know about you, but I am, I have like sweat on my cheek. It's how I attract the fellas. <laughs> That's it, march it out, come on. We have one minute right here. How much you march, how fast, how big, up to you. That's it. Beautiful job, slightly longer warm up today. It's gonna come to about a six and a half minute warm up. We have about 30 more seconds right here. That's it. Pump those arms. Now pay attention in this last 30 seconds. What's the body telling you? What's talking to you? What's drawing your attention? Maybe whatever is drawing your attention is what you need to kind of release when we're done walking. Another 10 seconds. Three, two, one, beautiful job. What do you need to release? Mine's my lower back, yeah? So I'm gonna do some hip circles. You might wanna stretch out your quads. You know, it all depends, how do you feel? This morning on my walk, my hamstring was talking to me. It was saying, hey, it's not talking to me right now, so we're all right. Uh, okay, get a towel, wipe drink, We're gonna start with the cardio five minutes. So we're doing 20 seconds, three exercises. So after we've done three exercises, that's one minute, one round. We have five rounds, okay? Now I'm gonna to have to turn to the side because we're gonna have a nice wide stance. It's kind of a variation of the side lunge. If it's feeling really uncomfortable in the groin, your legs are too wide but make sure you've got something grippy, all right, so that you don't slip and slide. All right, we're gonna start in the next 20 seconds. I'm gonna turn my fan to me. Come on, fan, blow this way. All right, 10 seconds, are we ready? No time like the present. Legs nice and wide. The aim is to touch your alternate or opposite hand to the foot, three, Two, one, or the ground, side to side. We have 20 seconds here. How fast is up to you? So this side to side movement helps to work the core, as well as bending one knee at a time, gives us this side lunge effect. We have five more seconds here. And up, shuffle. Now I want the hands above the head. So take a look at my feet, they're kind of Tapping back. Yes, I'm making you jump a little bit. If you don't want to jump, you can always march. Okay. Good. Third exercise, a low kick. Now hands stay at the shoulder. And now the legs are coming forward. Good. I 
Again, if you don't want to hop, you can march. Nice job. Back to alternating side lunge. Try and touch the ground here. So we're in round two of five. Ten more seconds here. Now keep the chest up, belly in. Shuffle. Take it up, hands above the head. Low kick, hands by the shoulders. Your pace, okay? So if you want to go faster, that's up to you. Heading into round three. Three, two, that side lunge variation. Now the more you, the closer you get to the ground, the better but your chest is lifted. You're not rounding that back. Maybe eyes looking up and forward. Five more seconds here. Shuffle, hands up above the head. Legs coming back. You could also do a step back if you didn't want to jump. Lots of options here. Low kick. In three, two, side lunge, round four. Oh, you're feeling that. I'm feeling it in like outer thigh, outer glute. That's it. Come on. Nice job. Shuffle. Hands above the head. So we do some jump training to help the joints. Low kicks. Hands by the shoulders. Heading into your fifth and final round. Here we go, side lunge, legs wide. Touch as low down as you can. Maybe it's the ground, maybe it's your ankle, maybe it's your knee. As low down as you can. Side to side, shuffle. Take it up high, hands up. Yeah, no break in between. Transition from one to the next as quickly as you can. Hands up, hands up. Aim here is to get those hands above the head. Low kick. Look at my hands, we're like little T-Rexes. No. Take them to the shoulder. In five, four, three, two. That's your five minute cardio, well done. White drink. Oh. All right. For complete recovery, I want two minutes of rest here, so you have quite a bit of time. We're heading into the strength training set. So we're doing kick, count, kick stand squats, push ups to failure, kick stand deadlift. All right, so now because kick stand is unilateral, works one side of the body different to the other, we'll do the right, then the left, then down to do the push ups, and then right and left in the deadlift. All right. That's about 45 seconds. You've got another minute 15. Take a drink, a sip. 
Now I'm going to start with two weights, one weight in each hand. You don't have to do that. You could do one weight in both hands, yeah, up at the chest, because you kind of need it out of the way. All right? Or you could do no weights at all. Depends how you slept, depends how you're feeling, depends what you did yesterday. Or, you know what? Depends how you feel right this second. All right, we have another 40 seconds. So I'm gonna start prepping my strength. I'm gonna grab my weights, have them nearby. We're starting with a kickstand squat. All right, so we're gonna make sure that when we come into that kickstand, we're gonna start with the right leg back. So we're gonna push all the weight into that left leg. Gonna hold the weights at the side of the body or up, if you have one weight, up at the chest. Let's set up. All right, so grab your weights for me, please. Good. Take that right leg back so that the toe is in line with the heel of the left foot, but the right heel is off the ground. Let's go. 10 squats all the way as deep as you can. 10, 9, push into that left leg. 8, 7, deep as you can. 6, 5, 4, Three, two, and one. Good job. Put the weights down. Walk it forward and back. Make sure you don't trip over your weights. Good. Shake it out. Let's do the other side. Pick up your weights. Set up your left. Toe in line with the right heel. Left heel off the ground. Ten squats. Let's go. 10, push through the right leg now. Eight, 10, eight, she can't count. Eight, she can. Seven, six, five, four, deep as you can. Three, keep that chest up as high as you can. Two, and one. Good job. Walk it forward, walk it back. All right, come down please, push-ups. Now we're gonna do as many push-ups as you can do in 20 seconds. Let's go. Three, two, one, as many as you can do in 20 seconds. This is what to failure means. So technically, you know, if we weren't doing a class together, you would go until you can't go anymore. Elbows need to go back, slightly out. Come on, however many you can do. And rest. Good, that's 20 seconds, good. All right, stand it up, shake it out. Part of the workout is getting on and off the ground. So the least amount of assistance you get with your hands, the better. All right, let's go, pick up your weights, please. Kicks down the right leg back. Now the weights are in front. Deadlift for 10. Three, two, one, let's go. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, Come on, three, push that chest forward, butt back. Good job, put the weights down, shake out the legs. Walk it forward, walk it back. Walking backwards really good for the tibialis, just make sure you don't trip over anything. Pick up your weights, kicks down with the left, weights in front, three, two, one, let's go. Deadlift, 10, nine, eight, seven, six. Only bend that right knee slightly. Want to work that hamstring. Four, three, two, oh, one more, one. Good job. Get rid of the weights. Shake it out. 
wipe drink. One minute break. Okay. That's round one. Can you go heavier with the weights? Could you maybe do the push-ups a little bit faster? These are the things you need to ask yourself so that you're able to apply in the next round. Okay, we're starting off with cardio. So get rid of those weights, make sure they're like out of the way completely, you know, so they're not gonna like get in your way. We have 25 seconds. What, drink? Three exercises, 20 seconds each exercise, five rounds. Are you ready? And now you know what we're going and doing. Now you need to push a little bit. All right, let's go. Legs wide in three, two, one. Let's go side to side. Remember, your chest needs to stay up. Eyes need to stay up and looking forward. A long front neck. And you're touching as low to the ground as you can. So if it's not the ground, it's the ankle. If it's not the ankle, the shin. If it's not the shin, the knee, the thigh. All right, here we go, shuffle. 20 seconds up. Big, quick trends, yes, that's it. Now, where are your hands? These ones I want to drive up past the head. Low kick, pop those arms. Now to shoulder. Now I'm straightening the arm. Yeah. Side to side, quick transition. Quick transition. Now I'm straightening the arms up over the head now. Yeah. Low kick. Quick transition. This is the end of round two, three rounds to go. Side to side. Now take a look at your toes while you're doing this. Make sure your feet are parallel to each other. I don't want so much of a turnout. Oh, shuffle. Low kick. So the aim in the shuffle is that the legs go back and the aim in the low kick is that the legs come forward. Hey, hey, what's happening with the hands? All the way, come on. Let's go. This is round four. Maybe you can take those legs a little wider. Maybe you can move side to side a little faster. Make sure you're bending one knee at a time. Shuffle. Look at my hands. They get straight above my head. Straight, straight. Low kick. Look at my hands, straight. Yeah? Come on. All right, we're heading into our last minute. 
Can you push yourself? Side to side. Again, those hands straight above the head. Low kick. Again, those hands straight beside the body. Heading into your two minute rest. Come on. Let's go, let's go. Three, two, I want to encourage you to move. Yeah, forward and back. So walking backwards is something really healthy. Yeah, it helps with balance. So practice it here. All right, that's about 30 seconds gone. Well, 40 seconds now, we have a minute 20 left. Wipe drink. Round two of the strength training. Now, if you felt like the 20 seconds for the to failure push-ups, can't really do to failure here because we're all like, you know, we'd be doing different amounts of time. That's why we're just timing it. I want you to speed it up so you feel like you're getting to failure in those 20 seconds, okay? That's the aim. All right, we have less than a minute. <sighs> Need to tighten my heart rate monitor. Getting sweaty and slippery. Okay, we have about 35 seconds. Take your last sip, take your last wipe. Keep moving forward and back, yeah? Cheers. Cheers to round two. All right, we have about 15 seconds. Kickstand squat. Let's get going. Grab your weights. This time we're going to start left leg back first. Legs are hip width. Take that left toe in line with the right heel. Make sure the left heel is off the ground. Chest stays up. Three, two, one. Ten of them as deep as you can. Ten. Push into that right leg. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two, all the way down, all the way up. Bend over, put your weights down. Walk it forward and back. About a 15 second reset. Allows for a little bit of recovery. All right, here we go. Other side. Pick up your weights. Kick down the right leg. So the right toe is in line with the left heel. Right heel is off the ground. 10 squats deep as you can, let's go. 10, nine, can you hear my knees cracking? Eight, it happens. Seven, there's no pain, just cracking. Six, five, four, come on. Three, all the way down and up. As deep as you can, one more. Get rid of the weights. Walk it out. Forward and back. 15 second reset. Oh, they're about. Okay. Come down on the ground. 
20 second push ups. If it wasn't enough time for you to feel like you were near failure, faster. Three, two, one, let's go. Come on. Your pace, five seconds. Rest. Stand it up. Good. All right. Kickstand deadlift. Pick it up, please. Now the weights are in front. Still at the chest, same thing if you only have one. Starting with the left leg back. Line it up. I'm gonna to turn to the side so you can kind of see my positioning. Three, two, one. 10. Nine, go as low as you can. Eight, don't let those weights touch. Seven. Six, chest forward, butt back. Five. Slight bend in the right knee. Four. Stretching that hamstring and contracting on the stand. Two more. One more. Good job. Get rid of the weights. Walk it forward and back. So while we are resetting, we're dealing with mobility. Okay, here we go. Pick up. Kick stand with the right now. Three, two, one. Let's go. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Chest forward, butt back. We're past halfway. Two more. Weights apart. One more. Good. Get rid of the weights. All right. About a minute and a half break. I want to encourage you to keep moving. Oh, all right, it's October. All right, a couple of things in October. Arthritis awareness, breast cancer awareness. All right, please, if you're not getting regular scheduled mammograms, especially if you are later on in age, do it, ultrasounds, check, go to the doctor. Early detection for cancer is probably one of the most crucial things. I want to encourage you to check. So I just did, I got, I got cysty breast, but I felt like a funny cyst. Thank goodness it's just a cyst and or, the other thing they said was, uh, my fat cells in my, um, my breasts are dying. Lord, can the fat cells in my abdomen die? <laughs> no, that's not a funny joke, but, so that's actually what I felt. Apparently they calcify. They, they rupture and calcify and you feel them. Lucky me. Are we ready? Starting with cardio, five rounds. Normalizing health talk, right? Legs wide. Here we go. Round three, side to side. That's it. Beautiful. I do my little part to let us be reminded that disease is human. It's not that you're bad or weak. All right, here we go, shuffle. Hands up, up the head. Yes, I love, wow, you sprang up there. Oh my God, that was so beautiful to see. It was like pop. I love it, I love it. I love that energy, that focus. Are you ready? Low kick. That's it. Beautiful. Beautiful. Keep going, keep going. 
Okay, this is the end of round one. We have four rounds to go. In three, two, one, side to side. Try and transition as quickly as you can. Legs as wide as you can. Take a look at your feet. Are they parallel to each other? Are you touching as low as you can? Bending one knee at a time. I know, do what you can. It might be slower than me or faster than me. That's okay, your workout. Here we go, shuffle. Take it up. Nice. You got this. We got this. Low kick. Beautiful. This is the end of round two. Three rounds to go. I want you to get a raggedy breath. In three, two, side to side. Now keep that chest lifted, right? So you're engaging the core. Five seconds here. Shuffle. Up. That's it. Come on. You got this. Come on, low kick. Can you hear me breathing? I hope so. Come on. All right. This is the end of round three. We have two rounds to go. Let's get really uncomfortable because we have a two minute rest. In three, in two, in side to side. Let's go. Five seconds here, come on. Shuffle, take it up. Low kick. That's it, that's it. I know, join right back in. Come on, this is the end of round four. Your last minute, are you ready? I want you really uncomfortable. Three, two, side to side. Low kick. Come on. We have five seconds. Rest. Two minutes. Woo. Yeah. Strength training set. Oh, wow. Want to encourage you that movement forward and back. My hamstring's talking to me again, kind of hamstring into outer glute. Yeah, it's probably from my low back. It's getting better. Every day a little bit better. Every morning a little bit better. Keeping like, with my physio stretches. <sighs> Being very conscious of my posture. 
All right. Oh. All right. One minute left. This is your last round. So maybe you feel like you want to go heavier. Keep moving for me. Keep drinking. Keep wiping. Try and incorporate walking backwards instead of turning around. Yeah. All right, we have about 35, well, 30 seconds now. Let's get ready for our last round. Take your last sip, take your last wipe. Oh, I'm so proud of you. That pop up there, after that first side to side into that shuffle, that was like absolutely beautiful. I'm super proud of that. All right, here we go. Pick up your weights, please. Kickstand squat. Right leg is your kickstand, pushing into the left in three, two, one, 10 squats. Let's go. 10, all the way down and up, push through the left. All right, that's six, we have five to go, we're halfway. Squeeze on the way up. Good job. 15 second break. Fantastic. So another rev your engine under your belt. Okay, pick it up. Kick stand with your left leg. Squats as deep as you can. In three, two, one. 10 of them, let's go. Push into the right. Squeeze when you push up. That's six, five more, we're halfway. Nice job. Get rid of the weights. Walk it forward and back, 15 second break. Well done. All right, heading into the push-ups, come down on the ground. Okay, 20 seconds. Are we ready? In three, in two, in one, let's go. As many as you can do. Make sure you're straightening those arms at the top. Less than 10 seconds. Stand it up. Oh. 15 seconds. Walk forward and back. Nice. Heading into our kickstand deadlift. It's kind of like a unilateral deadlift or a single leg deadlift. Kind of. Pick up your weights, please. Okay, let's go. Left leg back first this time. Weights in front. Try not to let them touch, okay? Three. Two, one, back flat, chest up. 10, nine, push into that right glute hamstring. At six, we have five more to go. Squeeze on the way up, back flat. Good job. Forward and back. Nice job. That's three rounds. Okay. That's 30 squats on each side, 30 deadlifts on each side. All right. And about 60 seconds of push ups. Okay, here we go. Kicks down with the right. Weights in front. Three, two, one. Here we are. That's six. We're halfway, five more. Back 
flat, chest up. Two more. Oh, nice. We are done. And that was 15 minutes of cardio. Good. Just catch your breath for me, please. Wipe drink. Let's take a minute and then we're going to stretch it out together. I encourage you to walk forward and back, right? Move around. Good stuff today, proud of you. I hope you enjoyed that. All right, so tomorrow we are meeting for Hour of Power 13, and in honor of arthritis awareness, can we come in all blue? Any shade of blue, royal blue, cerulean blue, deep blue, dark blue, light blue, baby blue, turquoise, whatever. Even if it's your calso, we'll take it, we'll take it. <laughs> All right, so blue tomorrow to just bring some awareness to arthritis. All right. Okay, let's go side to side for me, please. Being someone that has psoriasis, got to watch out for psoriatic arthritis. So, awareness. All right, go to your doctor for that. Get meds for that. There's stuff that can help you to alleviate the pain. All right, you don't have to suffer and struggle. All right, big inhale for me, please. Legs wide and exhale. Now, when you do the next inhale, I want you to lift your ribs away from your hips. Big inhale, lift your ribs, exhale. Now do the same thing, but this time bring the elbows up to the elbows. Bring the shoulders up to the ears. Reach. Good. Now turn your feet out. Keep the hands up. Rock your hips side to side. Beautiful job. Exhale. Bring the hands to the hips. Drive down into a deep primal squat. And back up. Stretching out. Did a lot of side to side. And now we're going to come down and stay down. I'd like you to have prayer arms and your elbows to the inside of those knees. I want the elbows to push the knees open. <sighs> Beautiful. Stay here. All right, nod your head yes, as big as you can make it. <sighs> Good, fine, neutral, nod your head no. As big as you can make it. To the edge of that turn. Beautiful, find yourself in neutral, come to all fours. Oh, it feels good not to push those knees apart. Fabulous. All right, I'm gonna come over to the left and so that way you can see a little bit more of my right side. Taking that right leg back, calf stretch for me. Excellent. Beautiful. Taking that right leg, I need to move back a little bit, to the right side. Back flat, chest up. Good, walk your hands over to the left. Lift your right hand up and over, open up. Nice side stretch. Beautiful. And come out of it the same way you came in it. Bring that right leg all the way forward into that half runner's lunge. The left knee is still on the ground. Tuck the toes of the left leg, lift the knee off the ground, full runner's lunge. Kind of rock forward and back here. Nice. Place that knee back on the ground. Take your elbows to the thigh of the right leg. Beautiful. Let's open up the chest, keep the elbows bent, squeeze the shoulder blades together, lift the chin. Beautiful, reach the hands up and relax come out of it come to all fours however you do that it's up to you all right left side let's take that left leg straight back calf stretch hold it there push into that heel beautiful job all right left leg to the left side right here flatten that back 
going to move back a little bit. Walk the hands over to the right. Lift the left hand. Give me a nice side stretch. Fabulous job. Come out of it the same way you came in. Put those hands down. Walk it back to the center. All right. Left leg all the way forward. Half runner's lunge. Keep the knee on the ground. Tuck the right toes, lift the right knee off the ground. Full runner's lunge. Rock forward and back. As big as you can make it, or as big as feels comfortable for you today. Beautiful, place that right knee back on the ground, elbows to the thighs. Clasp the hands, push the palms to me. Spread the shoulder blades, lift them up over the head. Beautiful and come out of it. Back to all fours, however you feel like. Beautiful. Tabletop for me, please. Tuck your toes, drive your butt up. So we're in down dog, stretching out the hamstrings. I want both legs as straight as possible, pushing through the heels. Maybe the heels are touching the ground, maybe they're not. It's okay, it doesn't matter. Good. Walk your hands to your feet so you come into a forward fold. I'm gonna to turn to the side so you can take a look. Grab your calves. Pull yourself down. Bend your knees deeply. Roll it up for me, please. Come to standing. Big inhale. And exhale. Nice. Big inhale. And exhale. One more time. Big inhale. Look at your hands as they touch. They form prayer arms. Take those hands down in front of the body to the heart of the matter. Thank you so much for working out with me. Ah, rev your engine. Hope you enjoyed that. Have a fabulous day. Stay moving. See you tomorrow. All blue. Bye.